Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Leos. This is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, Leos. Let's see what's coming up for your general energies, guys. Before we move on to your love energies, Leos, you're going to be very patient today with people around you. That patience is always there with the horse again. You're just going to be loving, caring for people around you. You're going to love how everything is turning out in your life. You're just in that very loving energy, guys. Okay. It's just going to be emotional. And you're just concentrating on taking care of your emotions, taking care of yourselves. And making sure that you're emotionally, physically, em mentally and spiritually stable. And you're in that perfect energy. So you will be resting till you feel perfect within yourselves okay because you feel like something is missing you feel like life is not going the way you expected it to be or something like that so you will be concentrating on making your lives better by doing the things you love instead of doing the things you have to do even though you don't love it okay there is a difference so you will be doing things that you love to do and by doing that it is giving you more love and it's giving you more enthusiasm to life okay what do we have here we have this wolf kind of thingy i don't know i think it's a wolf i don't know what this is i think it's a wolf it's not a dog here i don't know if you can see this but so you might want to you might get involved in a teamwork or your person wants to be in a teamwork with you or what is say maybe people around you are kind of helping you with your work or they will help you with your work okay so you don't have to worry about it people are always there to help you you're just following your instincts and please follow your instincts whatever you feel gut feelings just go with it and you'll go you'll just be on the right track okay that's what i see here you're making sure that you're having good control over life you're being loyal making you also Today you might find yourselves in that very emotional attachment like if you feel like someone is little bit emotional to you you tend to attach to them like like so much okay if you feel someone is good to you you will attach to that person like too much if you feel someone is okay -ish to you or if they are even like helping you for just once you will just I don't know you'll just stick on to them you're just attaching too much to people around you that's what i'm getting here this is coming up for your love energies guys love energies love energies love energies okay you are kind of protective you're protecting yourselves from people around you or you're like protecting yourselves you don't want people to think that you're kind of acting emotionally distant from your loved ones or people around you are acting emotionally distant from you okay your day is just going to be satisfying guys okay you're being happy you're being satisfied with the day how the day is turning out to be because you're kind of happy you're kind of doing your own routine and you like how things are turning out to be with in your favor okay maybe is now your time to enjoy or something like that because that's what i definitely feel here you're now in that energy where you're happy you're stable you're really thinking a lot about how life is taking you and all of that that's what i'm getting here generally for you guys okay You're really thinking a lot about a lot about so many things at once and that might even not be a good energy because you you might get headaches or something like this because you're thinking too much okay but you're kind of happy with how the day is going to turn out to be and you you or your person this person hiding their feelings for you 
and they really don't want to be emotional to you but they really feel that emotions okay they're not just expressing it doesn't mean this person if they don't express it doesn't mean they don't have emotions okay that's all i see here with the six of pentacles again you just want to stay in that stable energy you just want stability in all levels as i told before what represents the horse again so yes guys that's what i see here guys your lucky color for today is pink and your lucky crystal for today's moonstone bye guys see you all tomorrow hi guys welcome back to my channel my lovelies so if you watched your reading part in the beginning then maybe like if you came across um this part this is just a divinely guided message from the spirit guides and from the angels like what does this person feel about you what are they thinking about you do they still care do they still love you for those of you who are in separation this will really help you to go on with your journey especially if you are in a twin flame or a soulmate relationship okay and the sole purpose of my readings is to help you all stay in your path guys to be honest most of us we tend to deviate from our twin flame journey maybe because it's so stressful for us but yes we shouldn't do that even if it's stressful okay so yes guys uh, this is a reading to kind of like help you all on your twin flame or soulmate journey or to help you generally in your love situations just hopefully guys after this reading you guys are smiling and happy i just hope so so let us just uh, take few cards to find out how this person really thinks about you how do they feel about you and the messages for you okay so let me just take some cards how does this person think about you i'm really sorry guys if you're hearing like the messages pop up i'm really sorry so let us just start off how does this person think about you guys okay so we have balance spirituality and practicality how does this person think about you so this person feels like you're someone who is really hard uh who is really like feeling hard to manage things a person who's really finding it hard to manage between your spiritual self and your physical self or it doesn't have to be a spiritual and a physical self it can be from a job situation to a house situation from love situation to job love and career family situation to career situation so this person definitely feels like you don't have that perfect balance between things and they really want you to have a good balance okay obviously this person cares a lot for you you can be also dealing with a strong water sign a strong pisces okay a person who has a lot of water in the chart mostly pisces in their chart okay and i can also see you guys with a moon, full moon in pisces this person will do what they want and will get what they want out of a situation okay so i will just take some uh, cards for you guys what is uh, what else is coming up let me just take some more cards this is how this person thinks about you they feel like you are not mature enough to handle the situation how do they feel about you the end of a tough cycle stuff cycle approaches this is how this person feels about you again a full moon in capricorn this person feels like you're very very responsible you're very outspoken i mean like you speak whatever you think about and they really feel this that are many good characteristics within you and really feel kind of like happy excited to generally have you in the life they feel like you're very exciting to work with you're very happy to bond around with they really like everything about you i mean like every aspect about you guys this makes them really feel secure it makes them really feel amazing it just makes them feel wonderful amazing and secure mostly okay this is what i can see here let me just take out some message cards so that you get a more deeper insight into your situation so 
Let me just say God some message cards, guys. Okay, so you're not afraid to be silly with me. We can spend hours doing nothing but talking. You, your body feels great next to mine. I feel the love you run your hands through my hair. So, this person, there is a lot of uh, emotional attachment. There is a lot of physical attraction. And there is also a very spiritual connection going on between you both. So, there is nothing like you don't feel comfortable with this person. When there is only physical attraction in a relationship, maybe you might feel a little bit uncomfortable you might feel a little bit different uh, whenever you're with this person or whatever it is but according to this relationship right here i can see that there is like no discomfort in your connection you both connect perfectly like there is a perfect connection going on between you both guys and that is what i can see and that is what like um, makes this relationship so very unique okay so this is all I can see here, my lovely. My lovelies, thank you all so much for joining me here, guys. And I really hope this um, reading helped you and it at least made you happy if you were from a doll or a very bad day. I really hope my readings make you happy. So bye, guys. See you all tomorrow. Till then, bye. See you all tomorrow.